<laughs> Dang, bro. So I'm here with uh, Ian Complex. Yeah. It's been a while. How you doing, bro? Good, good. Good. Um, we're out here in nature. Yeah. It's like the third one I do. Um, it's nice. Is it? Looks like a like a Elden Ring. Yeah. Kind of really setting. Does. Something might pop out. Yeah, I mean, we're definitely gonna get a lot of white people uh, popping. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of folks here. Yeah. I'm just gonna quickly like just at least say like. I feel like I haven't done this in an episode yet. Like, yeah. say thanks. To, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I haven't, like, done anything like yeah. that. And also, like, I mean, you gave me the first platform. Oh, yeah. Kind of do a interview thing. Yeah, so I feel yeah. like this Full is the circle. best episode Full, to just Full circle. Yeah, thank, yeah. I guess, the subs and right, people yeah. I've been watching. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, thank you guys. That's that's it. <laughs> hey, shout out to the people. Shout out to the people. No, they've been blowing yourself up, man. Yeah, like, yeah. They've been showing the love. And I feel like I haven't actually, like, said thanks at yeah. all. Yeah. It's, it's, like, an interesting... I feel like I've told you this before. It's like an interesting energy the show. Yeah. Because it just feels like, like I walked by in the park and I like sat down and then just listening to people. I've gotten that. Kind of talk about stuff, but it's yeah. like it's really cool because everything else kind of feels kind of, like even stuff I do feels kind of produced to a level. Like I know there's a lot mm. of work that goes into this. Yeah. But it's like it takes a lot of work to make it seem like it's just like yo, this is a conversation you're getting like the luxury to get into. So it's like. Damn. Kudos to you, because I, I, I have no idea. I appreciate idea. that. <laughs> that That's funny, because um, that's that's one of the things that I wrote down. Because yeah. uh, you, like, a lot of your back, like, your backbone yeah, is yeah. is being good at visuals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, like, I'm not that good at editing. Yeah. Every time I hop on, I learn a new thing. Right, right. So I, I solely just, I, my backbone is personality. Yeah. And, and make the guest no, comfortable. Yeah. No, yeah, it comes through. It, it comes yeah. through, for sure. <laughs> Yeah, it's like a, I, I think I got lost in the identity of it looking good at a certain point. Because there are some episodes where I'm like, this isn't the best conversation, <laughs> but it looks fire. So exactly. I'm like, I'm, I'm ready to share this. But like, yeah, it's it's a weird balance because yeah. it's, it's hard to, uh, especially nowadays where the visual is so important. Like, I wish every episode could just be audio because mm. that's how I listen to podcasts mostly. Like, I, I never... Until recently, I like I really didn't li- watch podcasts on YouTube. Mm-hmm. So it's like I'm driving mostly, and then that's like I'm just listening to them. So yeah. it's like it's like a weird thing because I, I love the audio editing. Like that's my yeah. favorite part of it, like building stories that way. But it's kind of just yeah. When I started off, definitely like the visuals was like like was a thing I kept yeah. trying to get. Yeah. And as I progress, I'm like, wait, yeah, this yeah. is. This is audible. Like right, that's the whole right. point of yeah, it. Yeah. From someone to listen to it. So I started like chopping it up the way I edit it, stuff. Yeah, like yeah. you know, if right now you laugh, right. I would cut it yeah. and then get another shot right, of right. you laughing. Uh, yeah, so it's yeah, yeah. you know, yeah. you have to find like a way for everything to transition. There's, there's a language to it, especially because yeah. I feel like not the field, not to be like we're leaders in the field of, of yeah, podcasting. Yeah. But I feel like funnily enough, there were so many in Florida before. Mm-hmm. Like I think a bunch of people are doing other stuff now. Like right. I can think of like a bunch of podcasts that were coming out around the same time that uh, Pro was, but like a lot of them just kind of came and went, like for whatever reason. But it's just like I like it was funny listening to that episode when you said you don't listen to podcasts. Yeah, like, I wanted to ask you, but like, how did you like how did you get into that if you don't like how do you keep consistently doing it if you don't listen to them? That's how I'm able to consistently do it because I don't listen to them, so I don't get bored of it, and I uh. never find what's re- I don't know what's redundant. Yeah. to mention. That's that's interesting. So that's I mean I listen to Joe Rogan, Bill yeah. Vaughn. Yeah. Um, I I listen to podcasts from yeah. here and there, but honestly, the clips. Yeah, yeah, is yeah. What I what's, the clips you know, are catch yeah. me. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's an interesting because I, I listen to like Bobby Lee and. A lot like Theo and kind of that extended yeah. family of like California comedians, um, alongside like the art artsy fartsy podcast and different yeah. stuff and some podcasts that are just people talking about nothing. But it's 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 interesting seeing like the clips out of context or the stuff that's getting yeah the most play and the most stuff and it's like kind of daunting having to think of like editing stuff to to grab people's attention it's it's fun though yeah and i'm when i started off honestly like i wanted to be so organic like yeah man i'm not gonna make a tiktok right, i'm not right, gonna do this right, i'm not yeah. gonna do that yeah but then you start doing it, like yo wait this is kind of fun right because you 
you realize at the end of the day it's a game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. I, I, I like playing with the algorithm. Yeah. Like I've had sleepless nights where I'm just like, okay, I have to do so and so. Even with Instagram stories, right. like I'll I'll test out, okay, I'm gonna post I'm gonna do like I'm gonna post ten stories yeah. on a Saturday at at eight yeah. to see how many people are gonna engage. Where's yeah. the engagement yeah, at? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now I've I've realized, okay, if I post you know, I've had, I have like my schedule Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday yeah. at 6 p.m. Yeah. You know, if you get off at three, that gives you three hours uh, to not do shit. Uh, and then if you're bored by six, you can watch. Yeah. If you get off work at six. That's crazy. That gives you time, like, wow. you know, maybe 30 minutes yeah, or an hour. To get it in. Yeah. You, you tune in and it's just like, I mean, there's, there's a lot of science to it that yeah. people don't think that right. I'm thinking about, but I'm obviously, you right. know, that's. Yeah. You know, the whole time you're trying to beat the algorithm. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's it's crazy because it it grows so much and like, I think of yeah. Instagram becoming a place that's less and less like yeah. beloved because they're making so many changes to compete mm-hmm. with like TikTok and and everything. It's 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 weird to like stay on your toes in that way because you yeah. don't have control. And like one of the things I'm trying to do right now is like the website and like make sure my YouTube page is like full up like exactly just, so people have a place to go to so it's not everything is like on one place yeah and it's like yeah i think you told me to get on tiktok <laughs> yeah bro that, <laughs> like that's while so ago. important redirecting yeah. your viewers yeah, to, yeah, yeah. to yeah. different outlets that you have yeah because i have people that probably don't watch my youtube but they watch my tiktok yeah and it's like that yes yeah. you never know where people yeah. yeah it's like you said it's a game it's like <laughs> interesting finding out like most of the people who like either follow you like mm-hmm. on the personal whatever like they're not gonna be into the podcast or into the show yeah. or whatever. and then that's not their fault like that it's whatever that's their interest. exactly but it's like I, I feel like a long time i was promoting to those people and i was upset i was like yo why are my friends like messing with these people it's like i, I like I, I don't get it but it's like oh wait i need to focus on the people who are already consuming this stuff, there you go i have friends that there. don't watch me at all yeah and it's okay it's yeah. not that's not my target audience. <laughs> right, right. They're just the homies. Yeah. Yeah. I mean it's just the way it works. Yeah. Can't I can't do much. But um Was the podcast your like first venture into like was it the first idea you had to be like I'm gonna do something? Um, I mean I've been on YouTube since two thousand eleven. Right, right, right. <laughs> so I've done like gaming, yeah, to do vlogs and like middle yeah. school. So I've had time to reinvent, rebrand. Yeah. Which is like kind of you know i have that upper hand because people that that start up now yeah at 17 18 they still have a lot of rebranding yeah. and reinventing learning yeah and then by the time that they do hit that gold mine some of them have already either gave up right right you get me so it yeah. does take a lot of you're not gonna get it yeah you know right now yeah. maybe the layout that you have isn't working out no yeah 100 percent. it so was not working out try another one. <laughs> and that's why like even with the like small changes like yeah. the 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 podcast fucking the, the logo the, yeah the logo yeah, yeah. The, the logo that's something that keeps you entertained yeah. you switch it up every yeah. time sometimes it's ass sometimes yeah, it's yeah. good and it's just like little things like that like niches yeah you wear you like you want to wear what is that tassel elbow probably or, I have no or clue. whatever but anyways I just bought like, this funnily enough I was at the thrift store yesterday I was like I know <laughs> I'm going to see this man I need to buy a shirt. That's kind of in the range of your shirt. You see, they I was they're like, niche. I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> tapping in for real. You know? Like I, but, you, but you, I'm glad that people ca- catch yeah, off to those niches. Like yeah. I throw on a little this, right, right, right. people see it, they're like, oh shit, he's the guy that wears the yeah. funky shirt. Different, yeah, yeah. And just things like that that people can pick, pick up, up on. on, yeah, yeah. Gravitate towards, but it's weird, like trying to, because it's one thing for like a show or a business. Mm-hmm. But I feel like recently trying to think about like my personal branding, yeah, and kind of not, not giving up on music, but realizing it might not be the most profitable thing to do right now. But you you can, bro. There's a lot of merging. You can merge yeah. things. But I think I, I'm like learning like this whole year. I've been learning balance because yeah. I know like I do too much, mm-hmm. and I'll tell people like. I feel like I'm lazy and I'll be like, I'm doing this, 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 uh, but that's not enough for me. And they're like, well, you're doing this, this. I'm like, but I could be doing something else. Yeah. So I'm, it's like a weird, like, I know I'm not giving up on anything and I know it's like, 
it's it's more of a, I I can do it at a different time. Yeah. But like I want to give most of the energy to to one thing at a time mm-hmm. and like just finish it out instead of like starting and stopping and starting and stopping yeah. and starting and stopping. But that, yeah, that's a good thing that you that yeah. you, I'm glad that you mentioned that cuz even me when I was when I was working a part time. Yeah, yeah. Right? Um it was even hard keeping up with the show. Right. So I can't even imagine working full time. Yeah. That, that becomes like a lot of the passion stoppers. Yeah. Which, I mean, I don't want to discourage you. No, no. But I'm, but I'm sure that you're already aware of I've, that. No, I've thought about it. Because, yeah. like, I, I haven't posted since I started working there. There you go. And I haven't stopped working on the show, though. Mm-hmm. Which is which is the thing that I was scared of. Like you said, like, oh, the jobs are going to take too much time. And then, especially for the first time working in a field that has to do somewhat with the show. Yeah. Like, when I got to that job, they are like, can you start a podcast here? And I was like... Wait, oh. what? Are you serious? No, yeah, like, because they're like, we need content. We need to, like, find something. So, like, they're like, we need to If you don't mind me asking, what do you even do? I haven't asked oh, you yeah, I, I actually work, don't know. I work at this company called Brandstar. Okay. And they're, like, uh, it's a company who, like, brings in companies to help them do better. Okay. So. So they they require investments? Is that, like? Yeah, kind of. It's, it's like, uh, if, if your company is, it's kind of like a collective kind of mindset okay like brand star is also like a tv network in a way like they have shows on lifetime and different places like that Mm -hmm. so they'll bring in people like hey you need a production we have a production studio your company can come inside with us and like we can do that work oh okay yeah so i work at a company inside that company called ilab which Mm -hmm. does like design and graphics and stuff damn so you're at least still around that creative yeah no which is good yeah and like my homie's there too so like i I'm, i'm in a good position but um it was the first time I was doing, like, going to work, doing mm-hmm. design, coming home, like, ah, I got to design. So I just was right. so stressed because I was like, this is too much of the same thing at the same time. But I kind of had to, like, flip it inside my head and decide to be like, well, this is a time for me. Like, I'm working in a place that builds brands. Like, yeah. This is my chance to build the brand of Procrastination Radio and make it something that's, like, right. bigger than what it was, like, I, I've like the people who have been talking to me about. I'm like, it's not a podcast anymore. It's like a network because I always wanted to have like multiple shows and multiple mm-hmm. hosts and multiple characters on the show. So, um, it's it's taken a lot of of time to build stuff, and hopefully, hopefully, like October, I'm gonna yeah. start putting more stuff out again. But but you haven't stopped working. No, I haven't oh, stopped okay. working. And that was that was that was my biggest thing. I was like, if I'm not putting episodes out, like I recorded a bunch of stuff that hasn't right. come out, and I don't think it will come out because. Now I'm at a place where I'm like, oh, I know exactly what I should be doing. Mm. And back then I was trying to find it. Yeah. And so I'm like, like I look at my old stuff and I'm like, damn, like, oh, you should have been doing this. should have been doing that. Yeah. Just to critique it. And uh, so, yeah, yeah. I, I, I've never stopped working on the, the show and I'm I'm glad of like what I've learned about it. Yeah. But yeah, it does, it does feel, especially with like, like I'm not competitive in a, like a negative way mm-hmm. but especially with like you like yeah. like your show i was like i was like damn he's, he has not stopped yet like he's, 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 he's kept going and i'm just here in, in my little house just doing my little stuff like i'm like all right when i get when i get going like i'm gonna be good but like in a healthy way yeah, yeah. it's like like you're in the community with me yeah, so yeah. it's like it's nothing like i want to tear your show down but it's yeah like, yeah I was like, bro like i'm i'm inspired by what you're doing and it's like keeping me pushing to to keep going but yeah it, it is like yeah like trying to explain it to some people is like they're weird about it like i'm like oh i'm i'm in competition with you kind of it's like it's like realistically it's like a little bit but yeah it's like, uh, in a very yeah, positive we, way honestly yeah i would say you're probably my only competition and i i know that uh there's uh the garage but the garage yeah. isn't it's not i don't want to fuck because, like, if I hear that I'm in competition with someone, yeah, yeah, yeah. that automatically boosts me up. And, like, right, right, right. 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 Like, and I, so I don't want to, like, I'm not saying that I'm not competitive with the garage, but yeah. they're kind of more like, like, they're a friend thing. Yeah, yeah. They're not. Their stuff is good, though. It, their, yeah. their stuff is really good. And and me and Malcolm were talking about this. Yeah. So, so, okay, like, my podcast and your podcast, yeah. we rely on on different guests. Right, right, right. With theirs, they have a lore, yeah. which is what... Like, Malcolm keeps up to date with their stuff. Yeah, yeah. I can't. Yeah, you're doing I mean, I'm always pushing doing, episodes yeah, yeah, out. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, <clears throat> Malcolm knows the whole lore. Right, like, he right. knows who this guy is. Yeah. Who the other, like, right. he, and that's, like, 
I feel like that's so hard to yeah, do. Yeah, it's a pocket. Because you have to watch from episode one to understand what episode Everything. six yeah, yeah. is about. And I feel like more people like that, kind of, because it feels like every week you hear something like, oh, you're getting right. up to date or you're trying to do And I, I definitely tried that, and <clears throat> I I don't think I'm the best solo podcaster. Yeah. I I don't. <laughs> I get, I'll get bored mid-sentence. I'm like, yeah, what am I doing? Like, I'm wasting time. Yeah. Especially with my friends, like, we, there's nothing that, I just can't find nothing to talk about yeah. that hasn't already been talked been spoken among about, yeah. us. But they yeah. managed to find yeah. stuff, like, I don't even know where they put yeah. it out of. Just but. bouncing off the energy, yeah, shout yeah. out to them, because that's a, that's a tough, but yeah, it's funny how there, there's niches inside podcasting, yeah. inside conversation stuff, it's, it's, it's weird to try to find your pocket, because I, I realized, like, maybe last week, I was telling my, uh, my friend who's gonna be like working with me on, yeah. on some stuff. I was like, I don't want to talk about my personal life as much on the show mm-hmm. anymore, because towards the end, <laughs> like if, if a guest doesn't come, like you got to find something, especially if you're like a locked schedule. Oh shit, that's how it is over there. For for me, yeah, I, I just was like, I I, I want to upload once a week, so I was like, I gotta find somebody to do something. But so, this is this for your job or this oh, for no, the brand? Oh no, for the job. Oh, okay. they're, they're like, a, I I don't even. I don't even think about the stuff they're doing with studio right. stuff because it is so fast paced mm-hmm. and, and so like it's very corporate you could say yeah it's, it's a lot of like the more i'm in these meetings and stuff mm-hmm. i'm like ah like it is really just like not who you know but how you say things to people mm. we're we're back. Back. um normally yeah. i wouldn't do like, we're back i just transitioned but yeah. at this point it's failed on us twice the yeah. gopro's gotten too hot we have to switch um we have to switch spots, uh, yeah. but um, me and Ian were talking about how like podcast is acting, acting, yeah. And I mean, we got into some more conversations, but we're just gonna pick it back up yeah. where we left off. And so yeah, podcast is acting like right now. We're about to have the same conversation <laughs> we just had. And at first, I don't. I think we both had in mind that we yeah. weren't gonna mention it. Yeah, no, but <laughs> I think I, I think that's a thing of like getting like back into the, the like everybody having yeah. a podcast mm-hmm. is like we're not even like veterans in the game no. some people have been doing like bill burr like yeah like people at tiger but like they've been doing it for years so but we already have an understanding of how right these things work and i, I think a lot of people who do social media kind of have the idea that these things aren't real to yeah. a certain extent like post-production or setting up and all, yeah. that, all that but like if we, if we both weren't <laughs> podcasters or yeah. both weren't social media people, and we had to re, com- like reconstruct conversations that we already had, right. or like even the like the knowledge of like holding back on a conversation, be like yeah maybe we shouldn't get into that because because sometimes that excitement is like good to capture authentically. Exactly. There you go. But yeah, sometimes you'll be in a podcast and something won't go right. Like Wi-Fi will mess up mess up. Like for me, like mm-hmm. the, the virtual stuff. Or somebody's mic isn't coming together properly, and it's it's hard to gauge. Like it's hard to be a host and control the situation mm-hmm. without making them feel like 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 you're attacking them. Kind of. Yeah. Like like don't like like don't it, don't move. Yeah. Please. Like, but a lot of this, you have to, like, baby the person. Like, yeah. You know, talk, yeah. talk them into right. the... Right, it's like, you're doing fine. Like, like so, yeah. where did your addiction come from? <laughs> Bro, especially if you somebody know? answers questions bad. <laughs> it's like, like, oh, where did your addiction come from? I don't know. And you're just like... You can't, how do I move right. on from there? Right, you don't pivot. And it's, and it's, it's a little frustrating. But I think... I think having to move that fast is like a yeah. skill that people don't yes. have and they shouldn't go to a podcast to like to be like oh we're gonna get popping podcast off off rip it's so easy yeah just record just shoot the shit and we're fine mm-hmm. it's like like no like may- maybe you can talk for an hour but it's like in a year can you scale that to 50 episodes yeah like how many people are gonna be engaged for 50 episodes exactly of you not saying anything anything because if, if 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 that's there like there's not not to say like this podcast there's a podcast i, I right. watch that they, okay. i nothing i get nothing out of it how do you feel okay 
I don't know. Like, I don't. Okay, I'm just going to be up front. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, emergency meeting. Yeah, though, emergency with, to come. It's, with, to me, it's not good. That's what, that's exactly what I was talking about. <laughs> that podcast is yeah. so bad. <laughs> I, I think, because, like, shout out Enya, because, like, Florida legend. But it's not good. It's, it's a, it's a niche. And, and they'd be having some of the worst takes, too. It's, it's a pocket. And I, I appreciate it for the pocket. It's I, I feel like that's one of the the, the podcasts that yeah. that uh that their backbone is lower. Yeah. Where you have to yeah. know what happened you in have to be, episode, yeah. whatever. Yeah, because I feel like they're not even speaking truth sometimes. Like yeah. they're just like having fun and, and doing whatever they want at that point. But the problem is a person who's watching that is gonna be like, I can do that. Right. It's like no. Not necessarily. Like it it, it isn't as easy as copying something yeah and then making it yours like it, it does take some storytelling it does take some creativity outside of just like like you're saying like titles and thumbnails yeah. and like h- how everything's edited how everything's put together like how, it's a, how there's, a, there's a beauty to it and yeah. i just want to rewind because yeah. we had this conversation before the cameras yeah, on, yeah. were on pretty much we're discussing how like how podcast has become the new gateway yeah and right. like th- this happens with all social media. Yeah, Everybody yeah. thinks that they can become a rapper. Everybody right, thinks right, that they can right. become, you know, an, an artist. Yeah, they can sketch yeah, things out. Yeah. And podcast has now become that's, this new that's one. That's it, yeah. And podcast is so easy from like the greater scheme of things. Yeah. Like, if you just look at it from a broad pers- yeah. perspective, it's turn your phone on. Talk. You and a buddy just talk yeah. about bullshit. Yeah. For but an there's, hour. A, there's a game to it. Yeah. We just had to reenact a conversation. <laughs> yeah. So it could be picked up. Yeah. We can upload it. And I mean, there's not there's not really anything else I I can add on to that. Yeah, I don't know yeah, if you yeah. want to because it's just it's like everything else. People think that they can do yeah. it and I th- I think the reason I started a podcast I didn't even want to start a podcast at first. Yeah, same. I like, <laughs> I would have loved to just play music, not say anything. And do and do whatever. Yeah. But I, I realized through the conversations, like, oh, I'm like picking stuff up from people. This is cool. Yeah. I, I would love. There's this show called the ASMR Talk Show on YouTube, that is just this guy in this green screen room with like the most random group of people every episode. And I haven't heard of it. They're just like whispering, and it's the it's the most like engaging thing. It, is it really, uh, uh, <laughs> bro? It, it, it it's like I mean you might not like it, but it's not for everybody. But like he just ran for mayor in California like a, a while ago. But the host was so interesting, and I was like invested in the host that I became invested in guests. Yeah. Like, like I think that's a in, that's another interesting to think about with like your show because yeah. I'm invested in you talking to people so i know you can talk to people i'm so glad that so i'm not necessarily like going that was such a concern of mine. For the, no. <laughs> i remember i think i brought it up to you because uh, yeah. i used to be like fuck do people like me or they're yeah. only here for the guests but i feel like now people have it's like 50 50 no yeah 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 because yeah. right because even that is a game for real because it's like who can i get that's like might have a little draw that they may not know me and they're, they're yes. people might mess with them a little more so it's like it's weird but it's like I feel like I wasn't doing that job well mm-hmm. in the early show because I was being so reserved and yeah. was kind of guarding my questions and kind of not saying how I felt about stuff that it was kind of just like, oh, guest is the focus of this thing. Have you have you had like that podcast grief or like you've you maybe already finished up an episode and you yeah. chopped it up yeah. and then it's like nighttime <laughs> and you're thinking, shit, man, why didn't I just say right. what I wanted say to this. say? Yeah, this, yeah, 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 for sure. So there, yeah, there's um yeah, but there's there's also somewhere I'm just like this was a really good episode. Like, yeah, yeah. I remember the maybe the first time I felt that like I did an episode with no struggle, even though it had a lot of like technical difficulties was like uh, Benita Applebaum, like a DJ. Okay, I mean I've heard of her. Yeah, and. It was like a really cool thing where I was like, "Oh, I feel like, like I've known you my life, like in my entire life, kind of <laughs> feeling like." Yeah. But I was like, "Okay, that's that's the like the pocket I need to be in every time. Where mm-hmm. it's just like we're vibing and we're we're kind of running together, mm-hmm. and not just that stale like, all right, I'm asking a question, you answer. I'm asking a question, you answer. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> but yeah, it's like it's like that formatting is is strange. Cause I've, I've I've had to get more strict with it. Yeah. Because I could I could talk. Like I'll, I'll, which is very weird. Cause I'm, I'm very reserved. I realize, but 
Well, I've got, I've got you. I've got you talking a lot. No, here. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I think maybe, maybe more. The last couple of years, I've been more yeah. in in my pocket of doing stuff. But in in the episode, I don't talk a lot. <laughs> I try not to talk a lot. I've noticed that. Yeah. And um, like Andrew Callaghan. Yeah. Or Cali, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. That's his name. Think, do you watch him? Do you like Andrew? I think Andrew is Channel Five. Yeah. No, he's good. So that guy, I've I've studied. Like I really like Andrew, yeah. and he has like his method where it's like, listen, don't agree. You have to try and be as neutral and non-biased. Yeah. Which, but, fuck. So, okay, I'm going to jump back into that. But I have, yeah. like, this struggle where I don't like considering myself an interviewer. Because I hate that. That's, like, the biggest thing. That, yeah. Like, yeah. it's like, no, I don't. Yeah. It's not that I don't care to know about you. But I'm not here right. to just, you know, I'm not Interview. Jimmy Fallon. Yeah. yeah. Which is my biggest a, concern. There's a thing that feels fake about that. Exactly. Because it's like, where are you from? <laughs> what do you like? Da, da, da. It's like, all right. Cool. So, and and I get I get like offended a little like yeah. that hurts me a bit when <laughs> I, I like, hear oh you interview cool oh so let's get the interview on yeah you're gonna interview me what kind of questions nah it's like no we're just here to have a yeah. conversation oh I used to hate that when people were like can we see the questions before yeah I was like bro I I don't know what I'm saying yeah. most of the time like I have like I try to like think about stuff because mm-hmm. I feel like with with like musicians and stuff I think sometimes they have. Like, I have in mind they have an agenda to push. Not like, oh, yeah. Because they get like, I want to promote something. For sure. Or I want right. to get my face out there. Cool. Yeah, LA Leakers, they definitely send the script to right. the label yeah. and they know what they're going to Because they got, they got checks and That's balances. That's why people don't like Charlamagne. Yeah, they don't yeah. Have, you exactly. can't send yeah. over a script and be like, oh, this is what. <laughs> right. Like, you might just say, who the hell raped this? <laughs> right. And like, whoa. <laughs> Like, where did that... And, there, and that's a niche. Like, that's a pocket of whatever. And you have the people who react to that and walk out. With, yeah. Like, so I, I wanted to create, like, a place where, like you said, not an interview. Yeah. Like, it's a conversation kind of just projected onto yeah. YouTube or wherever it is. You know, because I feel like even walking in as a, as a viewer, you might go into it with different like ideas of like oh this is gonna be like a static yeah. thing it's not gonna be like like i because like i can get in an interview with somebody and end up like crying for some reason yeah but it's like if it's a jimmy fallon interview like that might not, like that might not necessarily happen yeah that those, way. those those tears might be fake yeah 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 jimmy yeah. Fallon, but <laughs> but yeah yeah shit's a game like I, yeah it is a game man it is it is it is very much so a game and it's hard to not think of everything like that yeah since i started thinking about it like that like it's it's led me to not really like i don't really care what anybody does to a certain extent yeah i think some people think like the the phrase like all publicity is good publicity is confusing to me because i think you can shut down certain avenues by saying certain things and, and there's a balance to that because i don't think anybody should um completely filter themselves yeah or their views or opinions on things because i think that's how you get community how you reach people yeah i think i think there is a thing of uh <clears throat> like you said people trying to do anything to hold on to like an idea of like fame or because success to, to me the community and just like scene based things it yeah. feels like high school it's a lot of yeah. acceptance yeah yeah you know you have the seniors you have the people that have been doing it for a yeah. while so they yeah. think that they have some kind of um fucking, like power or something. yeah exactly yeah. some kind of leverage over yeah. here when it really isn't like that yeah and look i i don't mean a humble brag but yeah yo i've been doing this shit solo yeah 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 me gopro yeah. and i go and get like like maybe next week i'll do I'll do like a smoke shop club. Right, right. You feel me? Yeah. And I don't, and I'm, I'm garnering more attention than yeah, they yeah, are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But their whole thing is grabbing like these. Like right. They they always want like that that to Specific. be the target audience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that that yeah. scene of people instead yeah. of branching out. Maybe, yeah. Maybe stop being so filtered. And right, like, right. You know what? Maybe I, maybe I, voted for so and so. Maybe yeah, I yeah. don't agree with this. Yeah. Maybe I do. Yeah. You get me? Like, but I, I think it's like people are also. Sc- scared and i think y'all touched on it a little bit go. last last That's, episode yeah, but yeah. like you're in that scene yeah so if you say something it's gonna go around and people are gonna notice it but i feel like i would prefer that if i say something if i'm like yo i don't like green apples 
mm-hmm. everybody in the scene loves green apples. I'm gonna go to a party and they're like, oh, we're not gonna give them green apples. I'm like, good, thank you, valid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Instead of going to the party eating the green apple, like, ah, oh, I hate this. Like, right. I, like I'm drinking the Kool Aid. It's like, damn it's it. Like weird. <sighs> Fucking died. You know what? I think that this might end up just being like very audio based. Yeah. Like yeah, I'll, bro. I'll, I'll, I'll figure something. Out. Yeah, yeah, no. So we'll just keep good. it rolling. Yeah. But honestly, but, but but there's like a certain comfort to that. Yeah. Because if you don't if you don't like green apples, you're yeah, never yeah, gonna yeah. get served exactly, green apples, exactly. and you're never gonna know if you might right, like you them like, again. That's valid. That and is very valid. Yeah. <laughs> so, to, is that? That's just the thing. It's just like, I hate getting political. Nah, like I yeah. did last time, but it's like, you know, it's a group of. For some reason, it always seems to be like, the the, you know, the liberal side. Yeah. Because everybody's a little softer and, yeah. you know, they want their stuff served w- where it's cut and they want to be able to chew it easier. Yeah. And that's like, there's like a, too many safety nets there. Mm-hmm. And I just feel like, and to like be able to branch out and really monetize and just yeah. bring out your yeah. brand, you have to leave. A little bit, yeah. yeah. And, it's, and it's not, it's, I'm not saying that you should never try out the scene or yeah. test it out. You know, it's good. You get to meet po- people you know you like, you know you right, don't right, like. Right. But staying in it too long. Yeah. Like, like how many people do you know in that community that have been doing it for three years that have been able to get, skyrocket? Figure something out. Yeah. It's 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 frustrating because I I think there are a group of people who want to build things differently so that yeah. the next generation of people don't have to think about this stuff. Okay. Because it is kind of like, all right, we got to this point now. We gotta go to California or go to Atlanta or whatever. Cause it's like, yeah. this scene is toxic and this scene is doing that. So I think paired with the comfort of the scene, I think people are hearing or they're hearing too many, too many like yeses. Mm-hmm. Like I realized when I started working as a designer, how bad I was at designing. But you're getting a lot of yeses, were you? I was getting a lot of yeses. And I was like looking for the no's. Yeah. And I was looking like I was feeding because <laughs> there's a certain there's a certain type of person who works for approval. Mm-hmm. And I'm working for to, to get better. Like there I don't I don't want to be the same type of person I was yesterday. Exactly. Even an hour ago, whatever. Yeah. So once I got in a position where my friend Jackson, shout out Jackson. He would be telling me like, yo, like, I'm like, yo, what do you think of this? He was like, well, this is wrong. 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 You had a good idea here. Follow that. I'd be like, oh. And it's like new. It's so, it's right. like, wow, I've never heard this. Yeah. Word. I was like, oh, I'm kind of like, I want to fight a little bit, but it's like, <laughs> learn to be like, no, like you're not coming from a place of like, you're yeah, not you jealous go. of me. You're, you're, you're just like, yo, I know more than you. This is probably not the best way to do this. Yeah. And, and I think even opening it up to people who don't know stuff. Like yeah. I'll, I'll send something to somebody who isn't a designer, but it's like, if I'm designing a package for like a water bottle, it's like, you're probably gonna look at the water bottle. So it has to affect you outside of it looking good mm-hmm. design wise, outside of the math of that. So I think people in certain scenes and it happens everywhere are just in too deep and yeah. are just like, they That's don't the wanna problem. hear like, oh, your outfit might not be that good. Like, <laughs> like, like your art, your it's art so isn't, true. It, your art might not sell here. So they'll go to California and be yeah. like, why does anybody like me? And it's like, yo, like. If we didn't like you in Florida, what makes yeah, you think yeah, that we're going to like you? Like, but they're not hearing that. That's the problem. They're yeah. not hearing like, yo, this isn't good. And I think more people should, should hear that. Yeah. Like it's because you get to a place where you're so, it feels weird because I feel like so many people in the scene are very like to themselves yeah in those groups so it's like you're put on this pedestal Mm -hmm. of i'm the best thing around here and everybody is having to accept that right so it it it's like hard for you to fathom if somebody doesn't like it right because it's like you're kind of going against the the system like why Mm -hmm. are you why are you being disobedient to the system it doesn't make sense but I, I think there's so much room for everybody. And that, and that's like, even to myself, like, I, I love hearing, there's like, there's like a weird feeling of like discomfort I get when somebody says yeah. they don't like something I do. But it's like, okay, so I respect that. I don't have to push my stuff to that. But Facts. it's like, I, I appreciate that you said that. Mm-hmm. Like, you're honest with me. You say you 
didn't he didn't like something. Yeah. Cool. You have an opinion on something. Thank you. Like for exactly. standing on, on yourself and, and saying that. So I I, I think. It it, it 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 trickles down to so many things of like, people, like there's a lot of people in in those spaces that people don't like. Yeah. But it goes back to the thing of like people aren't telling them. Yeah. That they don't want them around, so they're around still. Yeah. So it, it just happens in so many ways, and I wish more people would challenge each yeah. other and and it doesn't have to end in a fight it doesn't have to end in a disagreement Facts. it doesn't have to end in me unfollowing you it's like yeah you think something different than me cool valid if, if it if it's a, if it's affecting my health or my family or yeah. like anything like that then that's the place i'll yeah, be like yeah. yo if i don't feel safe around you cool yeah. cool beans like but if it's something like you said you don't like my hair it's like i'm not yeah, I'm not gonna not talk to you. <laughs> that, that one might be more personal. Yeah, yeah. But <laughs> that, that might be. Yeah, yeah. I might have to <laughs> pull up on a that. But, but yeah, yeah, man. Honestly, I'm, right now, like, uh, like, eventually, I, I yeah. just want to have my own community. Yeah, like, yeah I don't yeah, want to yeah. join anybody. Yeah, I want to do my own. Yeah, and I want to keep pushing that like leadership. Thing right. Or, like, right. Like you can keep doing your own thing. Right. You know, you don't have to. You don't need. This guy yeah. who's been doing this for three years but yeah. hasn't, but he's so comfortable In that. that if you go back to his oldest shit, right, it sounds right. like his newest exactly, shit. Exactly, exactly. And there exactly. hasn't been any development any change, because yeah. gigs are still booking that. Booking yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. You get me? And because <laughs> it's safe. It's, exactly. They know what they're getting. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, I, I think me and my friend were talking about when Drake put out his new album. He was like saying that, like Adam, he was like, Drake is bad. You're right. And from my perspective, I wasn't thinking of... Like, I, I eventually agreed with him in the sense of, like, I knew why he didn't like this album. Yeah. I understood it. But... Because our other friend who was, like, traveling was yeah. like, this is the best Drake album I've heard. And I was like, that makes sense for him mm -hmm. because he's in the clubs that this stuff was made for. There you go. This guy's in an office. Like, he's not... That's not the, the pace that he's on. Yeah. So it's like... It's interesting because I'm like, both of y'all right, and I just didn't listen to it because I don't. That, I don't that really might just care. be like the the, the podcast like nature Mindset, in you, yeah, where yeah. you're just super unbiased. Right, right, right. But I mean, being neutral like that is great, man. Yeah. Because you know, I I can, I can have both people on here, bro. Yeah. Both parties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I don't have to agree, but right. I can listen. Yeah. And understand exactly. But I I think that's again a weird thing that I see a lot, is people go into conversations yeah. to have the same mindset. Like, they go into it being like, by the end of this, I'm just saying what I said and I'm not listening to anything. Facts. But you I can't think, have. I think we have to. Like, it's our default to go into a conversation of being like, I don't know where this is going to go. Right. But I'm, I'm going to let you talk and I'm going to listen and then I'm going to, like, yeah. figure out a way to move in this. So it's like, I, f I feel bad sometimes because, like, I don't, I don't think I can get into an argument with anybody. Like, I'm mm. very hard to argue with because I'm always like, okay, I see, I see your point there. And then I'll bring something up and then like, but like, why aren't you? Bro, you, you, you'll get better at it though. Yeah. Trust me. But I don't, I don't think I, I don't know. Not, it's not like. You don't like, have to look for it. Yeah. It's, it's not like I'm not speaking up for myself. It's more of like, I can see why everybody would come from where they're coming from. Right. So sometimes I think people looking for arguments don't get that satisfaction mm -hmm. from me. And I'm just like, you're just going to have to find it somewhere else. Like, yeah, it, like I'm not going like I'm I'm I want to try to like level with you and, and see where you're coming from. And I might just be like, yeah, I don't agree with you, but like, have a nice day. Like, I'll see you tomorrow. Like, cool. yeah. But most people want that. Boom, that fire, that energy that like, yeah. we're almost fighting type and of vibe. Honestly. I'm not gonna lie, like yeah. me outside of this, yeah, I kind of yeah. like that. I yeah, drive yeah, off that, yeah. like like I, when, I'm, when I'm playing basketball, right. I'm, like, I'm yeah. pretty good at ball. Like I'll, yeah, I'm yeah, just yeah. be honest, shit, but yeah, I drive, yeah. I thrive off talking shit. Right. Like just you know, right, right. talking down on you. Right. And lately, that's why, like I said, I I stop trying to get super safe people, and yeah. I want to get yeah. randoms. Yeah, I just yeah, want to yeah. get them on here. But then that's why I love Instagram because I can stalk them a bit. Yeah, yeah. And, and then I know like. Okay, like Jocelyn, she right. doesn't have infographics right, in her bio. Right, right, right. I kind of know 
off the rip right. that she isn't siding already right, right. somewhere. On something, yeah. I can still talk to her about my beliefs, right, but right. then also backtrack and be like, oh, right. okay, I understand where yeah, you're coming yeah. from. Yeah, yeah, because she wasn't backing down when she was saying her shit. Which I was she like, still, fire. she yeah. still told me, oh, look, I have more liberal views, but yeah. I understand yeah. why people do so right. and so. Right, right, right. And honestly, like, that's that's the, the, the game yeah. of Instagram. Yeah. You go through the account, you stalk yeah. as much as you can, yeah. and you get already, you have to, you have to be like prejudgmental yeah. and have some prejudice yeah, yeah, yeah. before having yeah. a guest so you know you know what you're getting into yeah 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 it's 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 really interesting this this like like you said it's, it's a game it's a science yeah. it's like it's math to it because yeah there's some people i i probably won't bring on the show for like moving forward just like because i i might not want to get into some stuff yeah about whatever they they got going on but it doesn't mean i don't want to talk to them mm -hmm. so some people like have asked before yeah and i'm like i i might not be ready to talk to you right now like i don't I'm, i don't know how to i'm not gonna lie if, yeah. if someone asked me to be on the show yeah. i automatically say no yeah. i don't like i don't like being asked right, right. i want to be out and yeah. do my own ventures and yeah be like, you yeah know what? this person come on the show yeah yeah yeah, yeah. so automatically i i have knocked down every person that has asked yeah i remember i i i got this dj i try to get this dj that um he was like my neighbor's best friend. Yeah. Had like a pretty good following. Yeah. And it could have been interesting. I tried to get him on. He was like dodging me. Then he asked me to be yeah, on once I started the... getting a little notoriety. Yeah, and I yeah. Shut him down. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like I just don't like being asked. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I, don't, I I feel like in some way this might just be the like the headspace. Like when they ask, it seems like they want a genuine thing, and and I respect that. Or they want to like flex something on I the show like i automatically always go like oh it's gonna be fabricated yeah yeah because exactly. they're like i'm they're like more presented about it. yeah it's less of like we're coming to each other it's more like i'm coming on your show and it's like no that's not the vibe yeah 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 no it's it's weird because if they're asking to be on your show that means that they already had thought yeah of what answers they're gonna give right me. So it's just right like, nah, right or i, I kind of like when people have come on who haven't watched the show before like that's kinda, my I favorite. I kind of asked them, I'm like, have you? And like, no. I'm like, all right, cool. This is going to be a weird thing. Because then by the end, they're like laughing and stuff. And I'm like, ah, yeah. If you would have known, you might have not been as open to this. Yeah. Or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I, I think that's good. Yeah. I feel super satisfied with our episodes. Like, that's, that was a good, that was a banger. Didn't it sucks that the video, hey. we couldn't have the video on as long as possible. But, yeah. uh, you now know, there'll gotta, be some kind of artwork. Yeah. Shit. They got to go to the true podcast format for once they gotta, they gotta they gotta connect to the original like the podcast gods wanted yeah you, have to tap you got in. the best of both worlds you yeah, got yeah. the video format and then you just got straight audio straight audio that's that's the best so this man. will yeah. really test my audience yeah 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 <laughs> and man i'm a numbers guy i <laughs> check those statistics yeah, bro. bro i really do. do you think people feel bad about like not getting because now you have that video <laughs> with, like 20 mm-hmm and if their episode gets like a hundred, like, do you think they feel the way about it? I feel like you're talking to the best person because I have a video currently that's yeah. like that math. 22,000 right. yeah. views. No, yeah, yeah. I saw it, bro. It's crazy. So, that's a really good episode, too. But honestly, no, just being consistent. Like, I, I know my yeah. average. I know why that video did. Uh, yeah. It was, it's a lot of luck. Yeah. A lot of luck. Yeah. And I did put the effort, too, in that video. Right. Was, yeah. We had to drive almost two hours yeah. to go to Boca. Yeah. I had to create several profiles on yeah. other dominatrix sites. Right, right, right. So it was just like, it was that felt like really like just the universe giving me like, here, fine. A time, I yeah. have the upper hand this once. Yeah. So that one I understand. Yeah. Can I replicate it? Sure, maybe. But as of right now, I'm being consistent. I know right. my average. Right. Getting 100 plays. Yeah. An episode. Sometimes it does better. Yeah. You know, just a numbers guy. You got to yeah. look at the statistics. Not even yet. though you don't want to, but... No, I was it like, helps. I was looking at your stuff because I was like, it did like eighty six really quick. Yeah. Like eight, like the last episode, it went to eighty six views really like damn, like like your stuff is yeah, is that moving, bro. <laughs> it's a, it's about to hit four hundred views. Yeah, today, that's wild. So, yeah, yeah that's crazy. I don't. <laughs> yeah. That is yeah. wild. Yeah. It's a lot of studying, man. Yeah. No. Yeah. That's it's it's cool to see people care about it like that because. You could have easily just been. I could have just been satisfied with that one video right. hitting twenty two. Like, and I think you said it before. I think I might have been in our conversation. Like, you could have just done a series of like 
not done with Atrix. I got the ass. Like just. A and bunch I had of, another one too yeah, yeah. that she wanted to, and I was just like, no, I already yeah. did the one and right. done. Is in exactly. Ingenuous. They're gonna be asking similar shit. Or yeah. Something. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. it. Yeah. It's it's a weird, it's a weird thing, but it's like like it's if you have that genuine. There's a will, there's a way. I'll yeah, yeah. That's, that's <laughs> the right. best way to put exactly. it. Exactly. <laughs> I was about to go in this long sentence trying to get there. <laughs> like, it was, it was like, yeah, good. We're fine. We're good. <laughs> that's all. No. Yeah. All right. That was, uh, I cool. love that episode. Yeah. So. Fire, fire. All right. You guys should definitely check out Ian Complex. Um, I have such, I'm so bad with outros. I, uh-huh. I wish I could give everybody this outro that I'm about to give you. Oh, shit. Where I'm just like, check out Ian Complex. Oh, yeah. He does podcasts. Yeah. He's about to reinvent himself. Yeah, yeah. He is. <laughs> the next big thing but yeah i'm working on outros i have to get better no, that's at fire. stuff that was a good so outro we're both learning but yeah yeah you guys enjoyed that and yep peace Take care. peace